Okay, let's turn to the story that's breaking late this evening. Just about an hour ago, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has managed to get through his first big reform, the insurance bill that raises the FDI cap in the insurance sector to 49% has finally been passed in Parliament. The key legislation pending for more than a decade was today supported by the Congress. Parties like the Samajwadi Party, BSP, Trinamul and JDU who opposed the bill staged a walkout. The insurance bill has already been passed by the Lok Sabha. It will finally become a law now. The cap, as I said, goes up to 49% from 26% when it comes to foreign direct investment. Let's go straight to our correspondent Ashar Khan. Ashar, am I to understand now that this is a renewed attempt being made to break the parliament gridlock? Will we see more reform bills being brought in in this budget session or is the Congress only willing to support the government on this one insurance bill? Well, uh, insurance bill is already done. The only bone of contention which still remains in this session is the land acquisition bill. In fact, today, today in the business advisory committee also, mm -hmm. there was a tiff between uh, the government and the opposition only on the land acquisition bill. Apart from that, by and large, in principle, uh, the opposition is agreed, the Congress is agreed on other bills. There are two other bills, that is mines and minerals and coal and minerals, which have already gone to the select committee. So, the only bone of contention which remains is the land acquisition bill. Uh, what we expect is that uh, late next week, from the select committee both the other bills will come back okay we will then look at this whether this is the start of some kind of a new new relationship that mr modi is able to build with the congress party when it comes to key economic reform ashar khan with that quick update insurance bill being passed in the rajya sabha